Hi, everybody. <coughs> Pardon me. It's Linda with LL Creation Studio. I have a Etsy share with you today. I hope everybody's doing fine and having a wonderful week. Uh, it is really uh, cold here in Kentucky, and uh, but I love it. And so I hope that your weather is holding up too. Uh, so I've got this is a grunge grunge and I've named her Grungy Chat. See the printed here? This was a fabric that I've had for a while and it, it was white white. So I have coffee stained it and then I uh, sprayed some rust paint, uh, some distress ink stain on, on her and here on the doily. But this is all 100% fabric, totally covered. She's got a four signatures and here is the back I think it's all French and then I uh, sprayed a little bit more of my rust uh, Tim Holtz distress spray uh, she hasn't uh, been counted uh, but she's got four signatures and I don't know how many pages that's going to equate to but it'll be down there by the time that, that this is, is uh, goes live uh, she's six by nine and let's open her up and, and see. Now the paper's inside and the look and the feel, like I said, is grungy. And the papers come from, uh, this is, hmm, I think it's a pink, uh, my porch prints. You know, I'll have to look it up and I'll put it down there below. But it's, it's a grunge and then you have the lace here, the doily, uh, the uh, metal and then I've got a flat pack pearl here you have some fabric and fabric that is that way and then I've already shown the back and then here's the front and the bottom okay now I can on oh, here is these beautiful pages that you're going to see it's all been uh, covered in uh, Vintage Photo is, is the ink that I use to go around all of the pages and to give it this grungy look. And so here you have this beautiful 3D lace on the cover. And you have an envelope here that has been uh, stained. And then uh, this is one of the envelopes that I coffee stained it. And then in the coffee staining, I put some acrylic metallic paint and, and it stuck you'll see the different ones throughout and then I did a little collage here with a doily and some cardstock and the, some fabric and then another one of these bronze uh, metal pieces and then this is from Sakita's coffee stains uh, site on Etsy uh, I've done several of her uh, paper packs uh, in other journals uh, recently but this is a grunge, and I will have her name down below. It's not Sakita's. And then I have a lot of these here. They're Tim Holtz little brads. Some of my painted papers. An envelope here that I stuck to the half of the clock. embossing cardstock so you can see them rhinestones sewing some stars here painted stars, chipboard stars. This is some of my painted paper.
pieces of fabric, a lot of tape, a metallic flat back pearl there on the dually. This is a double pocket and a strip of lace. I left all the tails from the sewing. Another one of those brads. I think they add so much to a page. I love the way this turned out. Some pattern uh, paper over cardstock. Another rhinestone right here on this uh, silk, sorry, silk. Some tissue paper. It's very eclectic, eclectic, isn't it? This is a dictionary page that I randomly stamped a lot of different stamps on it. You'll see a lot of old book pages, sorry silk being glued every which way. And here's another little flat back pearl, metallic. So what I did is I printed all of these out on 110 pound cardstock and then I coffee stained them on, on just this side, but some of it came through and even aged this and a beautiful color. This is also a real heavy uh, watercolor paper that I coffee stained and salted it and it came up with all of these puffed up designs that you've seen me using recently in, in a lot of my journals. I just love the way that they turned out. And here you have a back pocket and then also this pocket. Same with this one. A lot of beautiful paper here. This looks like a Kentucky horse, doesn't it? Fabrics. paper here. Stock. This is a bunch of little threads that I glued on this dually and then I put a brad right there and you have this different layers of lace there. Nice pocket. One of Sakita's 
uh, cards. And if you saw some of my earlier uh, journals, you'll see some more of those in there. And this is some of my painted paper. Here's another gorgeous horse. A lot of stars and dots. Some more stars here. Chipboard. Lace. And you have an envelope on this side. Here you can see a lot of that burgundy iridescent paint coming out on this on this one. Each one of them was different. Very unique pages throughout. Another rhinestone here. Some uh, gauzy fabric. Some more tape on one of my painted page pages. Another brad right here. Another rhinestone in the middle of that stamp. Another one of my painted papers. Some Tim Holtz tape. Some uh, Rick Rack. Did some more of that thread, gluing that thread down. And I have some lace and some fabric and a doily. And then you have more of that beautiful ribbon right here. And you can see it's all covered in, in this fabric. And here is the back. So this is Grungy, Grungy Chat. And she will be up on Etsy. And I thank you for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.